Hello, my name is Chad Lampton. I work in the cartridge engineering group here at Sun Hydraulics. Today I will be going over the dither frequency parameter of Sun's embedded amplifier and how to adjust it. Turn on the handheld programmer with the embedded amplifier powered on. Scroll down using the down arrow until you see the parameter called dither frequency. Factory set default for this parameter is 140 Hz. This is the parameter that we find works best on our test stand. However, 140 Hz is a recommended starting value. In some cases, other frequencies may work better. What you're doing when you're changing the dither frequency is you're changing the frequency of the pulse width modulation of the output signal. What this does in effect is cause the valve to oscillate. This oscillation is used to stop friction from building up inside the valve. By keeping the spool inside the valve moving, you will reduce the friction between the spool and sleeve. So what we'll first do is ramp up the input to about 6 volts, and as you see, the spool is vibrating, which is why the position is changing so rapidly. And what you'll see is if you change the frequency of the dither, the oscillations will change accordingly. If we go up in frequency, it will vibrate faster, all the way to the point at which you can't physically see the oscillations. As we go back down in frequency, the oscillations will increase in amplitude. You can also turn off the dither frequency. With the dither frequency turned off, what you'll notice is that as you sweep the input, the spool will have a tendency to stick. Right there you can see that the spool is sticking as you're sweeping the input. When the dither frequency is turned off, it is actually set to 1000 Hz. This setting is so high the valve won't respond to it. However, when we turn our dither frequency back on, you'll notice that this sticking tendency is no longer present due to the dither. If we increase the frequency to 200 Hz, you'll notice that the spool shifts its position much more smoothly, whereas before, with the dither off, it sticks. Thank you for watching this short video. Be sure to watch our other instructional videos featuring Sun Hydraulics products. And as always, please visit us on the web at sunhydraulics.com.